Painting helps me process feelings. And family, friendship, relationship, and world events. It, it helps me process energy. And so for COVID-19, I, I wanted to create a work of art that it's not so much making sense of it, is a place for all this crisis, chaos, and the tumultuousness of emotion to just land. But interestingly, I avoided coming to, into the studio for a few days because I knew, I knew, I knew I'm going to paint this and I'm going to paint this. And I didn't want to feel the feelings. Hmm. But that's not what happened. I came here to work on the virus, to work on our world crisis from the perspective of finding harmony. And that's what I found. And it just reminds me, that's what my work's about. It's about working with so much um, intensity of experience and finding the common thread, finding the balance point between shapes, be, between the lines, between the color. I, I say I, I say I, I'm a naturist, I, I'm a nature ab abstract artist. I'm painting nature. The nature of our sentient experience and the nature um, of our feelings. I, I love the shapes that transpired in this painting. I love the messages. Like this figure here. She, she looks like a, a haloed spirit, a haloed saint. It, there's such a quality of the caregiver, the, this beautiful, this beautiful synergy that is occurring. You know, we're all in this together. And I, I just, I've just been seeing that people taking care of people. You know, I, I heard a story of this young couple that moved into a neighborhood and they, 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 um. Um, went around with a, a note around the neighborhood and offered to do groceries, offered to do errands for people. There's, this is happening. You know, so much love, so much care. And that's in here. That's in this piece. My, my work guides me. Even, even the color and the messages that colors have guides me. When this, oh, I, this was so black, and then I worked it and brought in the green, and I brought in the subtlety of blue, but I kept wanting to be dark. Which is, you know, it's a suffering. It's a suffering in the world. It's here. And then there's this movement of all the shapes, and there's such a beautiful um, sacred tone to it, sacred shapes, the, the Star of David, the Merkaba, and the spirals, and I've got this a wonderful dream catcher in here and I didn't intend it it just it comes and there's figures and so much energy I just love that I can capture that that I could capture that harmony in a time when <sighs> there's so much intensity of experience people are losing their jobs people um, People I know are going bankrupt. I know there's, there's, and, and then there's huge catastrophizing, and and some of it is valid, you know. And then on the other hand, on the other extreme, there's people that are in denial. It just fascinates me. There's so much, a full spectrum of experience going on, and it's here. It's here. It's in these shapes. It's in this form. And what I'm looking at is the way it's coming together, the way it's bringing 
us together as a world community. That's my prayer. That's my prayer.